Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Oh, shoot. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. <laughs> my whole pizza just slid out the box, y'all. Now see, they know they know better. Hi guys, if this is your first time to my channel, <clears throat> consider subscribing. Y'all, let me, hold on for one second, y'all. Give me a minute. Because I really, oh my God. I really want to talk to you guys. I know y'all read the caption. I know you guys read the caption and, um, I hope you all will be here for what I got to say about the situation. Oh my God, I cannot believe these people just did this. And you know what, y'all? On top of all of that, these folks didn't even give me a fork. So listen, I got wings and y'all probably won't be able to see the food as I eat. I mean, you'll see it as I eat here, but you know, whatever. And then I got the Mexican pizza, but it's all distraught at this point. Y'all don't forget to thumbs up the video. Let me pray over my food right quick. Okay, let me put some hot sauce. <clears throat> Actually, it's the Diablo, y'all. This is my Mexican pizza and she all toe up. But we gonna keep going. Let me put a wing right here. There's the taco. But this, this will be my first time trying the wings. And I'm good and hungry. So. Y'all like my little puff ball? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> so the last video I did, y'all, I was just laying back on my bed and somebody came in the comment section and they said that Truth Hurts and Killer Killer were moaning. <laughs> over on her channel, which I don't watch Truth's uh, channel. And so I went over there because I thought it was hilarious that like the person said that they were moaning, like like sag moaning. So I was like, hmm. So I'll go over there to see what was going on. And when I went over there, I was shocked. I was shocked. Let me say that my heart goes out to Miss Bethany. Um, because as I started listening to the audio, and in my opinion, that's her on the audio. I heard her for voice. <clears throat> I heard her voice very clearly. What shocked me because I was in the comment section on somebody else's video and they said they couldn't tell that it was her. No, it's distinctly, in my opinion, her voice. It's easy to hear her. But I'm sensitive to sound, so you know what I'm saying? I knew that if I there <clears throat> that if I heard it, I would be able to tell whether or not it was her voice. So but my heart goes out for her because normally we have things in our life closet. 
that we don't want to have spread all over social media, right? Um, <clears throat> and the audio and the video that was shown over on Truth's channel is a lot. For everybody to see, to hear, to talk about, and to react to, and, you know, laughing and giggling, and, you know, all the things that we do. And then my heart went out to her because we all have indiscretions, but they're not plastered all over everywhere for, for everybody to see. You know, some have even done a lot more than what she's done. And the indiscretions are not there. So for whatever reason, <clears throat> the universe has allowed this to happen to her. And my heart goes out. Because <clears throat> this is not a movie, this is real life. Now KK, he had a right to share his experience, you know? But I don't know exactly what the motive is on his part. But I told y'all in another video that I did. That I didn't think that his story was, story was far-fetched far at all. Like, it sounded true to me. Because I understand that we as humans, I just talked to a client about this. <clears throat> that normally we have a front side and a back side. Some people talk of, some people say flesh and spirit. Some people say we have a lot light and dark side. Some people say we have a spirit and a shadow. You know, we all have different ways of saying it, but it's, it's the truth. And typically we're not <clears throat> experts at life. <laughs> and so sometimes we make choices. Some people say mistakes. <clears throat> in the audio that I listened to it was five hours of information being shared personal private out information <clears throat> the sons were discussed the husband in great detail the receipts were crazy there were so many receipts the timeline <clears throat> I've listened to some other content creators and basically they called it a conspiracy mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. There's also a group of people in the comment section who say, <clears throat> absolutely not. This is not true. And for you guys, you need to live a little bit more. You understand what I'm saying? And don't never go about talking about when it comes to people saying what's true and what's not true. Sometimes we even make those kind of claims about our own children. You don't know, you don't know if it's true or not. Just don't, <clears throat> don't say that it's not true. You know, future wise, please don't. It's just not wise. Y'all, I'm going to tell, lean into the side. <laughs> it's not wise. It's not wise. <clears throat> Oh, it's not true. Others say, I can't see it. Why not? Why can't you see it?
because he got missing teeth. That's ridiculous. Don't never say what a person will and won't do. That's just, just not, it's just silly to do that. My heart goes out for her though. Because it's humiliating, I would imagine. Mm. Y'all, this Mexican pizza is so good. And for her husband, it's got to be <clears throat> humiliating. I was watching the video that she did when she was getting her hair done when the husband was helping her dye her hair. <laughs> so cute. You can see the love between the two. I think that's what they want us to see. It's easy to see that they love each other. But the kind of energy that I think she had for KK was entirely different. <clears throat> Y'all, these are good, by the way. Got a good taste to it. <clears throat> so, loving two people at the same time. It's gotta be complicated. And choosing to let to let one of them go because of your image. Oh my God, what a decision! KK said in the video that she said that she had to stop seeing him. She knew that it was wrong. What's up there? 
Let's so all think about that. Obviously, she liked seeing him. There was something about being with him. Something that she wanted and something that she needed. It just makes me feel like is she, is she satisfied now? I know she loves her husband, but is she satisfied? Because she's young. She's young. If she was my best friend, I would ask her. Are you satisfied? And I will also say, if, if she said that she wasn't, then I would let her know that she has options. And some of y'all might say, sure, Wabowski. That's terrible. Her husband is a good man. It's hard to find a good man in this world that's not what I'm talking about I would ask my friend is she satisfied because you only get one life one you can't live it for your mother your brothers your sister your child excuse me your best friend you can't live it for those people you got to live it for yourself. So I would ask her if I was her best friend, friend, are you satisfied? And friend, what do you want? Not friend, what do you think is right? But friend, what do you want? That's what I would ask my friend. If my friend came back and said, I don't want the marriage anymore, but I'm afraid. What will people say about me? Then I would say to my friend, it doesn't matter what people say about you. They're gonna talk about you anyway. But friend, what do you want? And then I would help my friend go about to begin to make choices and decisions to line her life up with what she wants because she doesn't have babies her children are grown she can't live for you you mom and daddy sister brother husband or children or people on youtube subscribers and people in the comment section she can have what she wants that's what i would tell my friend you can have what you want you have options now split everything right down the middle Continue on. You only have one life to live. One. That's what I would tell my friend. I wouldn't tell my friend to live in an unhappy situation because she has millions of dollars. I wouldn't tell my friend that. Money ain't everything. I know some people here, maybe you think that money is everything, but it's not. That's what I would tell my friend. I would tell my friend she has hella options, <laughs> actually. <laughs> uh huh. Certainly, you can't live for people and you can't be worried about what people think. Oh, God. Because technically, friend is feeding a lot of people. Like people who have these tea channels. Mm -hmm. These All these folks is piling up on these tea channels at night. 
and and commenting and laughing and giggling and talking and suspicious and giving their opinion and all that stuff friend those lives friend is feeding them mm-hmm so don't worry about friend i would tell my best friend listen don't worry about what the hell they say <laughs> it's your life and you can live and you can live how you want and you can do what you want friend because you have options friend Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. if you would tell your friend that leave it in the comment section Yeah. To ask someone to sacrifice their happiness for another person is too much to ask anybody. It's too much. Mm -hmm. What y'all think? That's what I would tell my friend. Mm -hmm. because she has the golden ticket it's her with the ticket and in my opinion this has not tarnished her brand in my opinion to me this creates a path for her to live how she wants to not according to what the church say not according with what mom and dad and the husband and all the children say. <laughs> I know what it's like being a mother and a wife. Sacrificing your happiness for people, especially when you raise children. It might be time for her to live her life. Mm -hmm. That's what I would tell friend. <laughs> Y'all, I'm telling you. That's how I see it. Mm -hmm. And certainly I would tell her Don't worry about what the name say I wouldn't care nothing about it Especially when she's feeding These tea channel people okay. Y'all it's raining so hard So bad I don't like the rain Yeah friend can have whatever she likes Friend can do whatever she wants. Friend don't have to worry about that. Friend needs just a couple of people around her that is committed to her having exactly what she wants. Mm -hmm. Friend don't have to live unhappy. Friend don't have to sacrifice her happiness. There was a lot going on on that video. Mm, mm, mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sometimes y'all we make life choices and we think it's the right choice and it's it's not. And what we're sacrificing and what we get what we give up. Life didn't ask you to give certain things up. But you have to be bold. Like friend has to be bold. <laughs> Unapologetically bold for what she wants. Mm -hmm. Being in the 50 club, honey That 50 club's energy ain't no joke You understand me? We say what we say We mean what we say And we understand that life Life is worth living And I promise you If she was my friend I would help her do exactly that she doesn't owe anything to the church. She don't owe nobody nothing. You don't owe them nothing. Sometimes ever, sometimes people can just, just glean off of you. You know what I mean? I think about people like, I think about folks like Whitney Houston and Michael Jackson, you know. How Ma Michael Jackson was made to be the person that he was. And then, you know, he created wealth for 
you know, the people that was around him, the family first, and then beyond that, other people, business people who were eating well and living well on because they were working with him in his business. And so there was a table there for all of them, but Michael Jackson wasn't happy. Same thing for Whitney Houston. You cannot live for other people. <laughs> Even if people are good to you, you can't. You can't. A message to the wise. You have one life. You have one. And it is our job to create the life that we want. One decision, one choice at a time. And that's exactly what I would tell my friend. Leave it in the comment section below, y'all. Kisses and hugs. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And, and don't forget to thumbs up the video. Let you know. Let me know what you think about my opinion and my perspective. I want to know. All right, y'all. Bye.